<clears throat> All right, shalom, shalom. Before I get started, I want to give my honor, praise, and glory to our beautiful power. Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Rakakadash. Brakati Yahweh, Brakati Yahweh, Brakati Yahweh, Brakati Yahweh, Brakati Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh. I want to give double honors to the apostles and elders of the Great Millstone that continue to do well. Okay, and um, honor to you, bros, that they're laboring in truth and sincerity. Okay. Likewise, with the of brethren, they may look at the nation's face value, but their sea line indeed go back to uh, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, which makes them an Israelite. And uh, Shalom to the sincere sister that's put in an effort to please Yahweh Yahushai to the best of their ability. Okay. Uh, you know, and with that being said, you know, um, you know, I want to do a lesson, and you no know, Lord willing, I could just hit the points real quick. I'm on, I'm on 11 percent. You know, I'm at the job. You know, um, you know, at the plantation, man. Um, and I forgot my charger at the house, so you know, and the Lord been, I, I kind of been burning up through this lesson about this uh 50 cent burger shit. You know, and I'm doing it because you know, Lord willing, you know, a new listener or somebody, you know, that's just found out about the truth or something, you know, will uh, hear this video, you know, and understand that Esau Edom is never ever for uh, uh, Jake uh, uh, good or for the people good at all in general, okay? But ultimately, this is for, uh, they attack Israelites, okay? Because they understand uh, 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 attacking the Israelites and, and tampering with their spirit makes them farther away from them, uh, farther away from their power, you know? Yahweh Ba'ashim Yahshah, Yahweh, meaning he is or he is this in the Paleo, paleo Hebrew, Ba'ashim in the name of his only begotten son, uh, Yahweh Shai, you know, which people ignorantly call Jesus, but his true name is Yahweh Shai, meaning uh, our deliverer, our savior, okay? And Yahweh, Abba Yahweh, like I just said, means, um, means he is, okay? Um, you know, so I'm gonna just, uh, uh, hit the points and Lord willing, the video is edifying. So it says, cheeseburgers in my phones will mess up, you know, like I've been saying, my past videos, kind of hard to see on my end, but it says, cheeseburgers, cheeseburger, cheeseburger day, 2023, 50 cent double, cheeseburgers at mcdonald's deals okay so that's for mcdonald's okay uh it says today national cheeseburger day here here's all the deals and i think the de this deal ends thursday i believe then it said uh, uh wendy's selling one cent junior bacon cheeseburgers okay so with that being said i'm just on that okay I was going to, I'm going to just hit the scriptures, you know, and, and, and I'm going to just get straight to the points with the scriptures. Uh, this is 2nd Andrew 16 and verse 21. Behold, this shall be so, it's like it. This is 2nd Andrew 16 and verse 21. Behold, this shall be so good cheap upon the earth. Let me read it one more time. 2nd Andrew 16 and verse 21. Behold, this shall be so good cheap upon earth that they, that they shall think themselves to be in good case. Yeah, East, uh, Jake, you know, uh, think they're in a good case because this one cent burger shit, this 50 cent burger shit, but really that shit is poison. You know, you shouldn't be eating that shit in the first place anyways. You know, you shouldn't be eating no McDonald's. You shouldn't be eating no fucking uh, Carl Jr. anyways, man. Okay, but now especially it being so damn cheap, you know damn well uh, uh, there's some extra poison in that mug, man. You know, and they targeting Jake, okay? All of a sudden they want to come out with this 50 cent cheeseburger uh, 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 one cent cheeseburger shit around the same time, you know, they talking about this new, uh, uh, this new, um, variant of the C, the C19, you know, all of a sudden, you know, that's because they're going to probably make the people sick, you know, make people sick, the dummies that ate the food, have them sick, sick as a dog, you know, and they're going to, uh, uh, be the first ones to run to Esau for help, okay, because, uh, 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 they're, like the scriptures say, I'm going to get to their side as children. They're, they're dumb. Okay? But like I said, I'm going to just hit the points, you know, before my phone died. Okay? So this is 2nd Andrew 6. 2nd Andrew 16 and verse 21. And it reads, Behold, this shall be so good cheap upon earth that they shall think themselves to be in good case. And even then shall evils grow upon earth. Sore, famine, great, uh, sore, famine, and great confusion. Yeah, these our people are in great confusion. Okay, by now, to be real, man, you should even, uh, uh, and I'm saying this for a point when I say this, you know, you should even, uh, uh, these people should even have to know the truth for them to know Esau Edom is, is coming up with a, a sick plan, 
okay? Trying to pollute them, trying to get them sick with this uh, one sit uh, and uh, 50 cent cheeseburger shit, man. You know, that should be common sense to Jake now, by now, man. You know, but Jake still runs down there and still gets the food, you know, like a dumbass, like a dumbass, man. You know, that's why we don't feel bad for these people, for Jake's, because they're, they're gone. They're lost. You know, they're too far gone. And the only way they're going to get healed is through that fire, man. You know? Because the scriptures say, I'm going to get that too. Uh, uh, um, um, uh, uh, actually, I don't think I got that. I'm going to just quote it. No, never trust thy enemy. You no, know, just like how his iron, his iron rusted, so is his wickedness. You know, roughly paraphrasing. You know, uh, and, uh, 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 rust, you know, all it does is get worse and worse, man. Okay? You know, so Esau, Edom, all he's going to do is get worse and worse. He's never going to be for you... Uh, your people benefit, man. You know, especially Jake's, man. He doesn't even like, he doesn't even care about his own people. So why the fuck would he care about um, uh, you Israelites, man? Okay. Um, I, I have something I was thinking about right now, but I lost it. Uh, but let me just continue. Let me continue. Lord willing, comes back. You know. So let me get my next. Uh, It's Jeremiah 4 and verse 22. For my people is foolish. They have not known me. Yeah, man. If our people truly knew, if, if our people truly knew Yah Bashem Al Shai, man, they wouldn't be uh, falling for this bullshit, man. You know? But it's all good. Like I said, man, the two third got a role to play, and the one third oh, got the role, uh, got, uh, got their role to play, man. Okay? The two thirds are, you know, the stupid idiots uh, of the Jakes on this side, you know? The ones that, you know, ultimately the Lord does not care about them. No, uh, uh, um, basically the Lord gave him up to a, um, to a, uh, ah, man, what's the word? What's the, uh, to a, um, reprobate mind. Okay. To a reprobate mindset, man. You know, they, they, they're, they're beasts out here. Like the Christians say, man, they're brute beasts, man. Okay. They, they eat anything, do anything, you know, all the, for the flesh, man. You know why? Because they don't know you how, why y'all are shy. You know, when you truly know. Yahweh Yahushua, the true God of Israel, you know, your true power, man, it, it will make you move wiser, you know? You have that wisdom and knowledge, man. You know, you can put the stupid you, you, you ain't gonna put the bank down and put the sell that shit out of them, man, knowing this truth, knowing this knowledge, man. You know? You know, knowing this truth, knowing this knowledge, you understand that all this shit is poison, man. Everything literally here is poison, man. You know, with that being said, you no, know, don't be over righteous or nothing like that, you know? Don't be over righteous. You know, I, you know, G, I know it's a lot of GMO chicken and shit, you know? And then we still eat that shit, whatever. You know, that's why you got to pray over your food. You know, the scriptures say you're going to eat your food to follow among, among the Gentiles. You know, we understand that. But when it's like a one cent burger, a 50 cent burger or shit, yeah, stay away from that shit. You know, stay away from that. Because that shit is like too obvious. It's way too obvious. Okay? And I'm making this lesson, like I said, you know, for a new, a new, uh, uh, maybe a new uh, uh, believer. You know, let them know that uh, don't trust that shit, man. Don't get fuck how hungry you are. You know, you shit, get something else to eat. Go somewhere at least where it's quality. It's more, qual uh, the food is more, uh, uh, quality, quality wise. You know, if you ain't going to cook at home or whatever, you know, but let me, let me continue. Um, Jeremiah 4 and verse 22, for my people is foolish. They have not known me. They are sadist children. Okay. Yeah. Sadist, stupid. The Lord even call you guys stupid, man. Why are you stupid? Because you, you move in a, in a, in a stupid way, man. You know? You know, you guys are degenerates, man. You guys are going backwards, man. You're not going forward, man. You know, the true believers of Yahweh Shem Al Shai is moving forward, man. You know, it, it, uh, they, 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 they take care of their diet. You know, they care about their temple, man. Okay? They're not just eating anything that uh, is presented to them in their face, man. But you dumbass Jakes, man, you eat anything that's presented to you, man. Anything, man. You know, Jake out here eating alligator and shit, all type of shit, man. Bugged out. Okay? And they have not... And, and they have no understanding, you know, and we how, how know that because of the actions, what they be doing, man. You know, if they had understanding, you know, they wouldn't be eating no 50 cent or, or one cent burger, man. OK, I don't care if it was a fucking famine on a, on a I don't care if it was a famine, man. You know, a uh, uh, true believer ain't going to eat certain bullshit, man. OK, why? Because they have an understanding, man. They have that wisdom, that beautiful wisdom that you how about you, you know, you how shy ultimately, uh, uh, you know, uh, uh, gave them, man, the spirit, man. Okay, the Rakakadash. Okay. Um, 
They are wise to do evil, but to do good, they have no knowledge. Yeah, Drake is wise to do evil. You know, they, they got these schemes on a down pack. You know, they know how to do all type of evil shit to get to get the bag. OK, but they don't know how to, uh, uh, you know, stack up their righteous bag. though. OK, that's why, brothers, you know, and I say this to myself, for the we are very, very blessed, man, because the Lord gave us understanding how to uh, uh, stack up our uh, uh, our spiritual bag, man. And that's where it counts. That's where it's at, man. You know, that's how to, uh, that's how you're going to move correctly, man. OK, that's how you're going to understand it and know Esau fuckery, man, by this knowledge, man, you know, and continually stacking your righteousness, uh, your righteous bank account, man, you know, stacking your brownies with the Lord, man. OK, and I say that to say this because the Lord is going to uh, continue to protect you and continue to uh, have uh, continue to give you that sound mind. OK. Um, so let me get my next script, you know, I don't want to speak too much. He class, he class is 12 and 7. Okay, this is uh, Ecclesiastes, also known as Sirach, 12 verse 10. It says, never trust thy enemy. And I do have this script, so like it. I said I didn't. Ecclesiastes 12 and verse 10. Never trust thy enemy, for like as iron rusted, so is his wickedness. Okay, yeah, never trust thy enemy. Who's the ultimate enemy of you Israelites? Okay, who's the main characters in this in this story that we live in? Okay, evil versus good. You know, Esau, Edom being the wicked. And, uh, uh. You know, Jake, you know, is being uh, ultimately, you know, the, the chosen people of, 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 you know, yeah. So, uh, like I already broke that down. The iron, you can't. Uh, iron just gets worse and worse. You can't uh, uh, um, make iron better. I mean, not iron. Uh, rust. You know, rust gonna just get worse and worse and worse through time, man. And that's how Esau Edom is. Through time, Esau Edom is just gonna get worse and worse and worse. Okay, so him, with him getting worse and worse and worse, he gonna present worse things and, and, and uh, 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 present uh, um, more pollution to uh, 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 Jake, man. Okay, and you Jake, it's up to you, Jakes, to understand uh, and see that shit, man. Okay, if you don't see it, you know, like the scriptures say, let the filthy be filthy still, and let the just be just still, man. You know. Um, now I'm gonna read verse. Um, let me see. Let me read verse eleven. Verse eleven. Though he humble himself and go crouching, yet take good heed and beware of him. And though shall be uh and those shall be unto him as if thou hidest let me read it from the top eclax is 12 verse 11 though he humble himself and go crouching yeah you know he might present himself like he's really for your benefit you know like the scripture say undermine you know undermine you know goes into basically when he goes into these poor uh countries and stuff like that you know he goes there present himself like he's bit for their benefit but the whole time he got an evil scheme okay you know, an evil scheme to uh, take all their resources and, 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 and pollute their country, man. You know? So that's the same thing he's doing with uh, uh, Jake, man. Presenting it like, oh, for your, uh, this is for you. Uh, I'm doing it for you guys, man. Uh, take these jabs. You know, it's for you guys' benefits. Uh, I, I, making the food cheaper. It's for you guys' benefits. You know, but the whole time it's for, the, it's for you Jake's destruction, man. You know, to lower your fucking immune system to uh, make you more vulnerable, man. Ultimately, man. Okay, that's the goal, man. You know, because they trying to... Uh, 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 Cut the population down, man. All right, and I say this, man. That's something that we with. We you saw, you know, man. You know, us uh, sincere believers, the Abbas Mount Shai. You know, we with that. You know, because you Jakes are no fucking good, anyways, man. You know, and the reason I say that is because we put fear in you, Jakes, man. That Jake need, and Jake need that fear, man, because Jake is out of control, man. Okay, when they start seeing bodies drop, man. All right, but let me continue from my phone dies, so like you. Equal axis twelve and verse eleven. Though he humble himself and go crouching. Yet take good heed and beware of him, and those shall be, and, and though it's like an, and thou shalt be unto him as if thou hidest a uh, wit, hidest wipe a wicked glass, and thou shalt know that us had not altogether uh, altogether wiped away. Okay, no, yeah, like I was saying, you saw you know evil ways, evil tactics, and his evil ass uh, self 
uh, is always going to be evil. <laughs> if that makes sense. I said it kind of weird, but he's always going to be, uh, he's estranged from the womb. Let me say it like that. He's estranged from the womb, like the scriptures say. You know, estranged goes into, uh, goes into basically uh, uh, not affectionate to one another. You know, he's not affectionate to anybody, man. Not even to his, his own people, man. Okay? Um, so that's, that's, that's the point, man. You know? Let me, let me skip down to verse 16, you know, because it caught my eye. Ecclesiastes 12 and verse 16, an enemy speaketh uh, sweetly with his lips, but in his heart he imagineth how to throw thee into a pit. He will weep with his eyes, but if he find opportunity, he will not be satisfied with blood. Okay, yeah, he, like I said, he present like everything is good and for your benefit. Okay, but it says in his heart he imagineth how to throw thee into a pit. Yeah, in his mind, the whole time he's setting you up to destroy you, man. Okay, you got to uh, understand that. And, and, and I said scripture, and that, and that scripture I was speaking on undermine is in verse 17, you know, and I'll just read it. Uh, Ecclesiastes 12 and verse 17, if, 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 if adversity come upon thee, thou shalt find him there first. Yeah, man, you're going through it, man. <laughs> Guess who, who, who making you go through it? Guess who's uh, 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 put all his funds into making you go through hell, man, putting you in, in, in poverty, man, okay, making you sick. Who, who, who uh, funds that, man? Esau, eat him, man. Esau Edom does that, man. He, you won't see him. He's the one that's doing it to you, man. And if Jake don't see that by now, hey, fuck you. Honestly, fuck you. You're, you're retarded, man. If you don't see that by now, you know, he should be wiser than that by now, man. Jake should, should, should see that shit, you know. But, hey, it's not written like that, man. You know, like the scripture say, our uh, side is children like I just brought out, man. There's, there's People are stupid, man. You know? Um, Ecclesiastes 12 and verse 17. If, if adversity come upon thee, thou shalt find him there first. And though he pretend to help thee, yet shall he undermine thee. Yeah, he pretend to help thee, but the whole time he, he's plotting against your your uh uh um. He's plotting against your guide. I say I'm gonna say your guide because my last video, you know, don't don't neglect the guide of Yahweh by Shemal Shai, man. Okay, he doesn't want you being guided by Yahweh by Yahweh Shai because if you're getting guided by Yahweh by Shemal Shai, man, that's a, you you unstoppable, man. You know, this is a spiritual war, man, that we in, man. Okay, like the scriptures say. No, Salaki, you know, I feel longer than I expected, but, uh, you know, I'm trying to get it through Jake Head, man. You know, Esau Edom is not to be trusted. So, Proverbs 22. My phone is tripping. Uh, this is Proverbs 22. In verse 3. A prudent man foreseeth the evil and himself. Still pass on and are punished. Yeah, the wise, you know, the prudent elect, ultimately, man, they going to see that shit and be like, man, hell no. I don't give a fuck how hungry I am. I don't give a fuck. I, like I said, there's a famine, man. There's certain things that, you know, the elect is not going to eat. Because they understand that shit going to be ultimately that cultural trip. You know, these food shit, man, that shit evil, man. Okay, and Jay don't understand that shit. They don't ask. You wonder why you mad all the time? You have mood swings and shit. You know, you got low energy. It's because of fucking food, man. The food putting demons on your ass, man. That's the other reason why. You know, you shouldn't be consuming just anything, okay? Um, it says that prudent man foreseeth the evil and hide himself, but the simple pass on and are punished. Yeah, the simple say, oh, it ain't nothing. It ain't no big deal. And they get punished for that shit. You know, checkmate they dumbass because they not being wise, man. They just, they literally just going literally off the flesh, you know? And that's not, you ain't supposed to uh, live, you Israelites ain't supposed to live like that. Literally just living off the flesh, man. That's why you Jakes are ultimately going to die because you live off the flesh. You're supposed to live uh, by the spirit, man. You know, and I, when I say that, man, you're supposed to trust in the Lord, you know, and, and want him to guide you, man. You got to literally want the Lord to guide you, man. <clears throat> okay. You know, it's like if I'm talking fast, you know, my phone's on 4%. I don't got no charger. I really want to finish this video. It's like I got a lot of scriptures, I know, but it's all the scriptures that came to my mind at the time. So let me, let me get that. Okay, Proverbs 10. Proverbs 12 and verse 10. A righteous man regarded the life of his, of his beasts, but the tender mercies of the wicked are cruel. Let me read it one more time. Proverbs 12 and verse 10. A righteous man regarded the life of his beasts, but the tender mercies of the wicked are cruel. Yeah, the tender mercies of the wicked are cruel, man. You know, so with that being said, like the scriptures say, everything I'm saying is off the, is based off the scriptures. You know, Esau, he don't got no fucking mercy, man. Everything about this man is cruel and evil. 
got a, uh, uh, like the scriptures say, he, he, you know, he wake up, he can't sleep. I'm going to roughly paraphrase it. Basically, you know, he can't sleep. You know, he's not, he can't sleep without, uh, uh, um, no, he can't sleep. I'm gonna put it on a link in the description, you know, for time's sake, and my phone won't die. But he can't sleep without uh, um, uh, 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 creating some type of mischief for you, for you, Jakes, man. You know, creating some type of evil works to uh, uh, to hurt you, Jakes, man. Uh, basically, man, the church is going to man. Okay. Um, yeah. So the point is made on that. Point made on that. I got what two more. Water, yeah, about you know, shy man. <laughs> I pray to the Lord to keep my phone at least charged till this video is over. And Lord willing, this video is edifying. This is a uh, Isaiah 32 and verse 7. The instruments also of the cruel are evil. He devi he devised wicked devices to destroy the poor with lying words, even when the needy speak it right. Okay? And that's that scripture is plain right there. The instruments also of the cruel are evil. And that's one of uh this is one of uh Esau tactics and, and instruments, man. You know, this food, man. Okay, this food uh is heavy on Jake, man. This food, like I said, puts demons on you and can fuck up your you know pineal gland, man. You know, your connection with the Lord, man. You know, that's why, uh, you know, the apostles lately been telling, uh, beginning on us about our diet, man. And the water y'all about you, shy for that, man. You know, we got to have a, a, a good diet because, we, you know, we out here prophets, right? We call ourselves prophets. We got to have a, a, a strong mental, man. Okay? You know, we got to take care of our temple, man, our bodies, man, etc. Okay? But, but I'm going to just get my last, my next script. You know, that is going to tie in with this for my phone to die on me. It's in 2 Corinthians 2 and verse 11. And it reads, Lest saints should get advantage of us, for we are not ignorant of his devices. Yeah, we're not ignorant of Esau Edom devices. We understand this 50 cent, 1 cent burger bullshit is part of Esau devices, man. Device, man. Okay, to get you Jake farther away from your how about your high. To make your immune system lower. Uh, uh um, yeah, uh, uh, to lower your immune system. Okay, to, like I said, to make you vulnerable, man. Okay? Uh, uh, um. You know, I'm going to go to 2 Corinthians 11, look at the videos, for you're not ignorant of vices. You know, so that's why we say, fuck two-thirds, that only rap shy. Okay, we're going to see what's your own, uh, uh, you lean on that situation. You know, like the scripture say, our, uh, uh, my ways are higher than your ways. That's not that. Yeah, of course, his are way higher than his, uh, our ways, man. Oh, he's God, he's way, man. Okay? You know, so, uh, I'm going to say this, though, if I close my 1%, you know, so if it's Russian, I'm just throwing it off. Uh, you know, he, man, you know, they suspect what scripture saying, you know, say this to the fools, you know, uh, suspect, man, they don't point, you know, like you have to you, but the level is gonna be good, man. You know, let that truly trust in Yahweh Yahweh Shai, and always uh, uh, want Yahweh by Shemuel Shai to guide him. You're always gonna cry into him, man. Okay, and understand that uh, there ain't nothing without Yahweh by Shemuel Shai, man. Okay, you know. So, you know, with that being said, Lord, when this video is edifying, man, don't let Esau uh, Esau eat him to uh, deceive you. He's never, he never, uh, he don't know good. You know, he don't know good, like the scriptures say. You know, so I'm gonna just close out saying uh, Yahweh by Shemuel Shai. Uh, how about Shemuel Shai by Shemuel Kakadash? I want to give double honor to the apostles and elders of Great, of great Millstone. And uh, honor to your bros, labor, and the truth and sincerity. And uh, 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 likewise with respect of brethren and with you sincere sister. You know, stay strong, stay diligent, you know. And, uh, you know, with that diligence, you know, it's going to be a, 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 a fair trade. The Lord is going to keep on uh, uh, guiding you the right way, man. You know, and, you know, have uh, like I said, keeping a sound mind with you, within you, man. Okay, so with that, I want to say Shalom, Shalom, DTA, and a ball, 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 Shalom.